Moonlight Nana. Hello everyone, I'm Moonlight Nana and this is my fourth year Medibank Paint Pro tutorial video. Thank you for clicking on this video. I hope it can help you start off your first step in your digital art journey. In the previous tutorial video, I showed you how to use what you have learned about materials in your digital art, thus concluding the subtopic of cloud material. Now we're going into a new subtopic of the Medibank cloud service, which is cloud projects. So for today's tutorial video, I will show you how to save project to cloud and open a project from cloud. Please remember that we are still under the topic of Medibank Paint Pro and therefore an internet connection is needed for this. If that's clear, then let's start. Our last subtopic was about this icon, the open material dialog icon. The next icon after it is the annotation mode icon. But to learn more about the annotation mode, you first need to know how to save project to cloud. Why do you need to know about this first? Because if we click the annotation mode icon, this window will pop up telling you that the annotation mode cannot be used because the current project is not saved to cloud. Then it will ask you if you would like to save this project to cloud. If you click no, then this window will close and nothing will happen. But if you click yes, then the next window that pops up will be the save to cloud window. Now this is the window where you will save your project to cloud. Take a look at this window. We've got the theme, title, uh, color mode, and the description. Take note of this. For now, I'll click cancel. I want to show you the usual way of saving a um, project to cloud, which is the main objective for this Medibank Paint Pro tutorial. Alright, so say you want to save this current project to cloud. First, head over to the menu bar and click File. In the drop-down menu, you'll find the option to save project to, uh, where is it? Save, save to cloud as, sorry. Save project to cloud or save to cloud as. Alright, so you click on it. And then the same window that you saw before this will pop up again. This is the save to cloud window. Remember, just now I asked you to take note of the theme, title, color mode, and the description. They're the same, right? So, picking either the save to cloud as item or from the annotation mode prompt just now, both can do. They're the same. Now, take a look at this save to cloud window. Check out the theme item here first. The theme refers to which group you want to save this project to. For now, the only one that I have is My Cloud Saves. This is own collection of projects of your Medibank account. I have it and you will have it. It is a default setting for when you have a Medibank account. You can actually have more than this My Cloud uh, Saves theme. Like when you click this drop down, uh, click on this one and then a drop down menu will show you all the themes you have which you'd like the project to be saved to. I will tell you about the themes later on uh, when we cover the topic of annotation mode. For me, I am a one person team, so I just have my cloud saves team. Okay, so for the title, this is uh, straightforward. It is the name you want to set for the project that you're saving to cloud. So I'll change this to um, Medibank tutorial project. Okay. As for the color mode down here, this one is for you to determine what kind of project it will be. Clicking on this will uh, show you a drop down menu of three other options. And then here you can pick either to go full color, grayscale, or black and white. Since my current project is more to the 8 bit layer type, then I'll pick the grayscale. Alright, as for the description, this is where you'll be you'll write anything relating to the project. Uh, so for this project, I will type here. This is a uh, oops, Medibank Paint Pro tutorial project project video project. Okay, video. <clears throat> When you're sure about the settings about this project from top to bottom, then you may click OK. 
alright? Then wait while your project is being uploaded into the cloud. This will depend on the size of your project and your internet connection. You might also notice that uh, the title or the name of the tab in which the project is currently being saved is, uh, how do I say, will be changed, okay? So right now, you will see that the project is saved to your cloud when the title of the, how do I say, the tab will be over here is um, in bracket cloud, all right? And then if you see the word saving in a bracket, it means that it is still saving, saving online. Okay, once the project is saved on your cloud, then the title will have this cloud, the word, this cloud word in bracket. So now this project is already saved to cloud. How do we know? Let's check it out. I'll close this tab first. Okay, so to see all of your saved projects on cloud, head over to the menu bar and click file. In the drop down menu, search for the item open from cloud. Click it and a window will appear which will show you all your saved projects on cloud. So let's check for the project I just saved and it is this one. Okay, the Medibank tutorial project. Let's click on it and then click on OK down here. This action will open the project. Again, you gotta wait for it to be downloaded from the cloud. Alright, now the project is open. You can then continue where you left off. So then that is how to save, uh, that's it on how to save projects to cloud. Simply go to the file item at the menu bar and then click this uh, save to cloud as um, button. When you're done saving it to cloud, you can open the project or check out all your projects which you can save in cloud by clicking on this open from cloud item. It's easy to do, right? Now you can save your works in places other than in your computer and you can access them just as easily provided you have an internet connection. Anyway, for this window, I will be covering about this in the next tutorial video. I didn't want to explain about this window in this tutorial video because then it will take a lot of time. You see there are like lots of buttons up here and uh, so all these buttons and these icons is like gonna take a lot of time to explain. That's why I decided I will cover about this window alone for the next Med Medibank tutorial video. Okay, so that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial video of Medibank Paint Pro. Please like this video and subscribe to Moonlight Nana channel or follow me on Facebook. Together we help each other out in our art journey. Have a blessed day ahead everyone.